Hockey team back in the Ralph Engelstad Arena tonight, finishing up their series with the Colorado College Tigers. UNE looking to put back to back wins together for the first time since we flipped the calendars to 2022. UND lighting the lamp first midway through the opening period. Multiple skaters firing shots on goal, including Ethan Frisch. His first one goes off the pipe, then he knocks it back in off the goalie's skate. UND up one to nothing after the opening 20 minutes. They had another goal about six minutes into the middle frame. Matteo Constantini fighting for the puck at center ice. And once he gets it, he doesn't give it back. Constantini goes top shelf to make it a two score game. And they aren't done yet. Still in the second period here, defenseman Brent Johnson loads up from a long way away and snipes this one through. The freshman from Frisco, Texas, scoring his first career goal gives UND a three to nothing lead. Into the third period now in North Dakota, putting this one away for good. Another freshman tickling the twine. Jackson Coons posts up right in front of the net, sends the save right back. The rebound goal putting North Dakota up four to nothing, with just over 14 minutes to play. Break out the brooms. The 4-0 win secures the weekend sweep for North Dakota. It's their first perfect weekend since December 10th and 11th when they also swept Colorado College. Zach Driscoll secured his second shutout of the year between the pipes. UND now 17-11-1 overall. The Fargo Force in action at Shields Arena for their series finale against Tri-City. Fargo up 2-1 here in the second period. Storm creating some chaos in front of the net, but Loudon Hogg tracks the puck down. The Force clinging to their one goal lead. For now, that is. Leighton Road fires one shot directly into the pad, but he's there to send back his own rebound. That goal tying us up at two near the midway point of the period, but fret not Force fans. Fargo gets it behind the net, and from there, it's going to be tick Tack toe to light the lamp. Tanner Wallows with the go ahead goal, putting the force up three to two in the second period. The force skating away victorious tonight, five to three the final. They get to stay home for another weekend. Sioux City Musketeers come to town next week.